Hello everyone. Let's provide a solution to this problem. We have two root x okay over three x to the power of two equal to four. Okay, this is very simple. Um, the first thing is this two to the power of two will give four then this will go with this right so we have 4x over there and then 3 again to the power of 2 will still give us 9 and then x to the power of the same 2 will be down here x squared okay and then this is equal to 4 and from here do not cancel this and this okay what you would do is to cross multiply right because this is over 1 as well 9 multiplied by 4 will give us 36 so we have 36 x over there and it's equal to 4 x times 1 which is 4 x now the next thing to be done is okay the next thing here is to bring this to the left so we have 36 x to the power of 2 minus 4 x equal to 0. And if this is the case, then I can factor out um, 4 x because 4 can be found in this and it's there. So 4 is a common factor. And then Okay, it's not only 4 that's a common factor, right? 4 is a common factor and x is also a common factor. So we'll have 4x on the outside. And then 4 into 36 will give 9. Then x into x squared, we have 1x. Then minus, here we're going to have 1. Because the whole of this has been divided by this. Then close this and equate this to 0. If we continue, we can now apply um, zero product rule. It is either 4x is equal to zero or 9x minus one is equal to zero. From here, x will be zero over four or on this side, 9x is equal to one x from here is equal to 0 because 0 divided by 4 is 0 or on this side x is equal to 1 over 9 so we can conclude that x is equal to 0 or 1 over 9 but i would like to put this back into the equation to see if these two values of x will satisfy the equation 2 root x over 3x to the power of 2 equal to 4. If I put 0 in here, it will be 2 times 0 over 3 times 0. Now, it's going to be 0 squared, which will never give 4, right? Good. So this means that our x to be equal to 0 does not satisfy the equation but then let's put in the value of um, x as 1 over 9 so this is going to be 2 square root of 1 over 9 because x is 1 over 9 then over 3 multiplied by 1 over 9 now the whole of this will be squared now will this give us 4 as the answer let's continue right this is 2 multiplied by square root of 1 is 1 and square root of um, 9 is 3, right? This will now be over 3 into 9 is 3. So we have 1 over 3 on this side. Now this is going to be raised to the power of 2, right? And then what can we see from here? This 1 over 2 can just cancel, 1 over 3 will cancel itself from there. And we are going to have just 2 to the power of 2. And this is giving us 4, right? Therefore, the 
solution that satisfies the equation is x equal to 1 over 9. Thank you for watching.